guys, so it's literally Monday morning and it's 8.30 right now. I'm going to a spin class at 9 and I'm do going to a different one. I normally go to my studio um, like every single day, but one of my instructors it, like left my studio, but he still teaches at a ton of other studios. So I'm going to um, I'm going to a different one today. Oh my god, my neck. And I just literally hopped out of bed and I'm like in my car. Like I literally, like I just got up and like went downstairs and like I was, this is so crazy because I have literally no food in my apartment. I need to get groceries tonight. But like literally none. Or maybe I'll get groceries tomorrow. But um, yeah, so I basically had no groceries and I was like, oh my god, I'm starving and I hate doing fasted cardio. I just literally hate it like so much. Like it's, I, I just don't like it. And then I get in my car and I remember when I bought a bag of chips, like these like kettle chips yesterday at Whole Foods and I left in my car. The lighting got dark all of a sudden. Um, and I was like, wow, this is unreal. And I was like, oh my gosh, I don't have a water bottle. And then I get in my car and I remember I bought water yesterday. And then I was like, oh my gosh, I forgot my big hair tie. And then I remember I had a rubber band around my wrist just so I can put my hair in a ponytail because my hair is six day hair today. I'm going to get it toned so I didn't get a blowout or anything yesterday. But like, isn't that just psychotic? Like, that's so crazy. But it just worked out so well. And I literally was like, thank you, universe. Like, thank you. Thank you for my intuition yesterday knowing I was not going to have food and going to go to this. But I'm really, I don't know why it's so dark. But yeah, that's what I'm doing today. And it's really early. It's a 9 a.m. class. Um, and there's traffic, so I literally have to, have to leave at 8. It's, like, so crazy. It's, like, it could be three miles away, and it's, like, so much traffic. But I'm excited. It's my first time at this new studio, so I hope it's, like, chill. I don't know. I hope I get a good vibe from it. Because if I do, then I can start in the summer. After this week, I only have two weeks of school. No, no, finals. Um, but in the summer, I can start coming here on Mondays because I like to get an early morning workout. And, like, the, the, I'm like very picky about instructors like if you do spin you know what I mean like it's like a whole different vibe who you take it with like there are some people who I'd literally go run eight miles on a treadmill then take their class like it's so boring I have like two instructors at my old place and one of them was, this one left so I take the other one like every single time she teaches basically like five times a week but in the summer I, I like I need to be working out every day I like to work out every day it's not even like I'm like oh my god it gotta get so fit it's like it just makes me feel good i'm not like trying to you know actively like lose weight or anything like that i like my body um oh my gosh i have to like get over but no one's letting me over please oh my gosh guys seriously you bitches please come on please please dude seriously like I mean, fuck all y'all, I'm still gonna go, like... It's gonna slow down, so they're gonna have to let me in. Okay, I this one. Um... But yeah, so, I, like I was saying, I hope I, li hope I like this place, because I, like, I can start going here on Mondays. I go through ClassPass also, I use ClassPass. I always, like, leave a link. You get, like, a first month free, I'm not sponsoring anything like that. Everyone gets that link, so I just leave it for you guys in case you want it. These sunglasses are Vera Wang. I got them off Ditto because um, they, they they like they basically like ended their whole service and we're just like selling all their sunglasses and like everyone's like asking where to get them and that's where I got them and I can't even find them online but they're literally like these black Vera Wang ones. I like them because they're kind of like Ray like aviators but like I don't know not. I wanted to put in like little studs this morning but my ears are so sensitive even to real golds. I don't even know what I need to put in them. It's so bizarre. I don't know, maybe they just don't want earrings in them because I haven't had them in for so long. But also, I for this studio, I have to find, like, street parking and shit. And it's, like, more of a hassle, I guess. Like, I like when there's, like, a parking or things like that. And here, I just have to, like, I think they have valet, though. But I don't have any cash, so I can't valet for, like, tips. Um, I need to start getting cash also for the week just for, like, tips and stuff. Because I never carry cash on me. Literally, ever. Like, I also got a parking ticket. Um, I park like, I don't say illegally, but like, I park, there's so, in West Hollywood, there's a lot of street parking, and like, sometimes you literally, they're only parking a street parking for like five miles, and, and they literally only check it, like, basically you could park until, I don't know what, 8 p.m. or 6 p.m. every single day for free, for two hours, and then on Sundays, it's the only day, like, you can't park, but everyone still parks, even without a permit, because like, the, they check, they check it like, once every four hours, so it's like, I literally never got a ticket. Like I've been doing this for like a year and I finally got one. And honestly I'm not even mad because if I it's like if I divide it out every single day I illegally park there, like my parking ticket, I've been paying less than a dollar a day. So it's all good. Not even that upset. 
um, but yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm really excited to get my salon and I love this, this instructor. I like texted him, I'm like, coming. Um, and then later when I get back, I'm just gonna clean up my apartment. My hair toned at two o'clock. Just because I, my, my hair still hasn't picked up like a, an ashy color yet. Because it takes a while to get the extensions lighter. So I'm gonna go get that toned today. And then when I get back, I have to film and send over some videos. I'll get back from like my hair probably at like six. So it'll take me like until 10 o'clock to do video stuff. And then I'm gonna probably go to bed, meditate, go to bed. But yeah, that's what's up. I love you guys so, so, so much. I don't know, it seems like I'm ending, ending this video. I also need to, oh my gosh, after school's over, I have enough so many like little things I need to like get done. Like I want to get my car interiored again, but also I honestly I just need to clean the front, like it's fine. I just like like when it's really fresh and clean. That just murdered me. <coughs> I can barely breathe. Wow. Holy shit, that was, I feel like it was a little, I feel like he taught a little harder here than the usual, maybe because Monday morning and he was like, Let's whip these hoes back into shape. Wow. That was insane. That was like, wow. It was like sprints for the whole, four, it was a 45 minute class, which they normally are. And it was sprints the entire time. Like we would sprint, really fast jog, sprint, really fast jog, sprint, really fast jog. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. Now I drank this much water. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. There's a creation over here. I'm gonna go get myself a smoothie. A little Monday morning treat. It's only, it's only 9.48 a.m. Me, already burned like 800 calories. This is the content I'm here for. I used to wear my Polar watch to spin, just to like see how many calories, but I was always, it was always like around 700 to 800. So I stopped wearing it, because that's I'm like, okay, but, I go really hard, like I like sprint the entire time. Which I'll, some people will like, like just like slow. You, if you go to spin, you know what I'm talking about. You can like cheat. People like slow down. They're like, he, he's like sprint. People are just like kind of like doing a fast jog. I'm like going like this like the entire time because like I'm here to get a workout and it's like I'm not gonna cheat myself. Like when people do that, it's fine. Like if you're like genuinely out of breath and you're like tired, I get it. But like, like I'm not gonna cheat myself. You know, like I'm here to get like a toned ass booty nice booty nice stomach like i'm not here to like just like f around so i always like sprint really really hard during the sprint like like my legs are going so fast in the mirror and i like watching it like motivates me <laughs> i have to make a u-turn right now these people are not happy about it but i really have to sorry guys i'm so sorry like i'll be gone in a second because creation's back there i don't know, i don't know what smoothie i'm gonna get yet oh uh, Come on, come on, no, no, we're gonna get like a type of green smoothie. I don't know what yet. I'm, I'm like out of breath still. <laughs> wow. I think, I don't know why. I, I really didn't stop to breathe. I like stopped water. Like, I'm just like really out of breath. I, also because I didn't, all I had was those chips, so it was kind of like almost fasted cardio. Thank gosh it wasn't, but like I just had like a mini bag of kettle chips that's always in my car. I didn't really eat a lot of dinner last night because like me and Ollie went to Whole Foods at like 6 and I didn't eat since then. So I feel like I'm out of really out of breath because it was like, oh like, I didn't eat, have, it was like I'm burning a lot of fat versus like food. Because I'm like, I've never felt this out of breath after. But wow, that was so good. And the music was so good. 10 out of 10. Baby's back. I got myself. Oh my god, it's so messy. Uh, um, it's the Green Dream from Creation. I'm gonna research some like, cause you can custom make your smoothies. Some some custom made smoothies I can make that I like better. This one, this one has like kale, parsley, spinach, almond milk, and banana or something. Mmm, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Now I'm gonna drive home, shower, clean up, meditate. Ready to start this day, feeling good. I feel like everyone started their day with a workout, a green smoothie, and 10 minutes of meditation, it would be a happier place. 
but even even just hand sanitation which anyone can do from literally like anywhere you are it changes your whole day I tell everyone this in any consultation I have anything I just say I just my nail girl told me she has anxiety and I go just try meditating for 10 minutes a day she tried for a month and she, I came back and she said her whole life changed and I was like see and she's like I literally didn't believe you but I figured why not I always say that and if you're wondering like my I, I always get questions about what I'm wearing so I'll just start like addressing it I always try to link it if it's like I can still find it Okay, honey bun, I came first, but um, my jacket's Lululemon zip up, I'll link the zip up, they always have this one, this is a Victoria's Secret sports bra, I also link it if it's still online, and I'm wearing Lululemon Wonder Under, so I can link my whole outfit, I'll start linking my outfit of what I'm wearing in my vlog, if it's like, still up, you know, if it's not like from a few months ago, they don't have it, but it's like, these classic pieces, Lululemon will like, always have the black leggings, Lululemon will like, always have the black zip up. Hi guys, I went back home. I literally had to rush so quickly. I showered. I, uh, sorry. I posted like a video just to do like some of the thumbnails and stuff. And then I did my makeup in eight minutes. Um, I'm wearing very minimal makeup, just some mascara, um, lip liner, and brows basically. And then my hair is six to hair, so I'm about to go get it toned and like washed and everything like that. And oh my, there's like traffic right now. Oh no, that's not too bad. Okay. Wow. Dang. Cool. I thought I was gonna be late. I don't think I will be, but when I just got myself a, a very berry hibiscus refresher, and I also got one for my hair girl too, just to be nice. Spread the generosity. Put it out into the universe. It'll come back to you. You know. I'm wearing my favorite black oversized sweater from Boohoo that I hauled. That I was like, this is gonna be my staple sweater, and it is. I wear it like four times a week. I got my period today. Um, and I'm already a Gemini, so I'm a crazy bitch, and imagine me, I, I th thank gosh I'm like spiritual and meditate and center myself every day because, and do like work out just to like get to a good place, because imagine if I was like an unwoke, asleep Gemini, I'd be psycho, and I reflect back to some of my high school days, <laughs> yikes, um, but I guess I got my period, and usually I have really awful cramps, I literally like, I'm not kidding, it's like my mom and them too and everything like that, and I'm not gonna go out on birth control i like i don't believe i personally just don't agree with it i don't know i can like i'm not not in like a in like a religious way people are like if you get pregnant you should have the baby not in that type of way but just like what it does to your body hormone like the hormones in it and how it affects you and how what it does to your like i don't say mental health but it the things it does to your hormones i've researched for so long and i've talked to a lot of like more holistic doctors and things like that and it's just the shit that they put in birth control, you wouldn't even fucking believe. There's like a doc there's a documentary, it's very low key, it's on some website. Remind me and I'll like email my professor to find it, but we watched this like whole documentary on like what's in birth control. And I'm not dragging anyone who's on it. Like no, I, whenever I like talk about stuff, I feel people people are just always get so offended because they think it's like a personal attack, and nothing's a personal attack. Like you do, we do our best every day. We make the decisions based on what we know every day. So I'm not like blaming anyone who's like does something that i say like i don't agree with or like i don't do because it's like yeah I, i'm sure i do things right now that if i knew more knowledge i wouldn't be doing that and when i do discover that knowledge i won't be doing that you know, just like when you go vegan or when you start meditating like, you know what i mean like it's not like i imagine if i went before i meditated and people told me to meditate i'd be pissed i was like oh, i can't fucking believe it like no i'm so you have to be open-minded and like realize that like you don't know anything i don't think that anyone ever will ever know anything so like i'm so open-minded like tell me more but they basically put like a lot of awful chemicals and if you're into spirituality they put a bunch of stuff to keep your third eye close if you're like know what I'm talking about so I just like not my thing and yeah so that's what people are like I'm birth control like um, I'm not gonna pump myself with hormone just because one day I'm in extreme pain and yeah my mom always had really bad cramps and her mom didn't and I usually have like such bad ones like to the point where I have to like leave school or leave class because I would be like in tears and I couldn't move and, but if I take like three mitol, I know it's like a lot, that's the only way I won't have pain. So I took three mitol, but I can feel it wearing off after this morning. I literally got it on my spin bike. It didn't like leak anywhere, but I felt it like the initial pain. And then when I got off, I was like, nice. Um, and I still spun through it, which is insane. I can't believe myself. And, um, but yeah, so like I'm gonna have to post need some mitol when I get to the hair place. But yeah, I'm gonna get, grab her nasty thingy too. And yeah, I really just like, I kind of want to put like a general disclaimer like like I was saying it's like you know it's no one's ever I'm never I mean personally like I guess I can only speak for myself I can't say everyone but I never like say like 
when I talk about something I do or I don't do, I never want it to be like, oh, I'm better than you because I do this. Like, no, like I've discovered a certain amount of knowledge that's led me to this conclusion and therefore I align with what is the best for my health, my my soul, everything like that, you know what I mean? And so like if you want to do something, that it's fine. Like, I don't know, I feel like whenever it's, it's okay to be doing different things, I feel like a lot of the time in our world when someone does something, I don't know, it could be literally, I think it could be like the way they plant a tree, the way they, I don't know what kind of clothes they wear, how much they choose to work out. I feel like whenever you talk to people about what you do, it almost always it turns into this like discussion of like who's doing it right. Like you get what I'm saying, like whenever you talk, not with friends, but like in general, like any normal conversation, if you break it apart and look at the like the rhetoric behind each side, everyone's kind of basically like a lot of the times, I'm not gonna say everyone, but a lot of people frequently kind of it ends up getting into this like who's doing the right like who's doing it better who's doing the right thing and it's like sometimes there isn't like the right thing because what's right for you isn't what's what might be right right for me you know what I mean and yes if like there are general things that you want to do for your health like I don't know you can't really argue that like for example like working out is bad for you because you know what I mean it, like it's just I'm maybe in, someone's gonna bring up like but if I have this health condition okay I'm sure if you have a certain health condition where it's not good for you but I'm saying like general like endorphins like you feel better good for your body like it, again I'm talking about there's general statements that if when applied to the majority are correct oh my gosh hi you want hi <laughs> sorry too hard thank you why so late why so late different schedule today switching it up <laughs> you always come like around yeah, today a little late, 1, 1 p.m. We start right now tomorrow. No, no, I just like ch ch change the schedule today. Yo, Thank you so Thank much, you. have a good have day. day. You too, take care. I love him. We are best friends. Mm -hmm. I, we're literally all bros. It's amazing. Today's vlog is long because clearly I'm in like a talkative mood. Maybe because I, I don't know, I'm just like, I'm just, you know. You know how I am. You know how I be. <laughs> I also am going to film a really exciting haul I think on Wednesday or Thursday it's gonna, It'll be up this week But yeah, I want to wanna say like a quick I love you guys I love reading all the comments Especially in my vlog You guys are so nice And on my main channel You guys just are incredible And also so many of you I, I, I think f five of the spots for the 10 week miracle class are filled So there's five more so if you want to be in that 10 week program, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I talk about it in the vlog that I'll link below, but I'll also link where you can buy it on my website. And yeah, there's five more spots left. Literally within the first day, five people already signed up and I was like, oh my gosh, I love you guys so much and I'm so excited. I literally was crying on my to my mom on the phone because I was feeling so grateful and I was like, I, I'm creating like all the materials for it. They're basically all ready and I'm just like so excited. So if you want to be into that, there's five more spots left. And yeah, I love you guys so much. Just, I don't know, I'm feeling very like, like I just love you guys so much and I just love, well I love when like someone will tell me that something I did made their life better. Like that just like, I don't know, I could cry. I don't want to cry. My makeup is like already kind of smudged because I meditate, my eyes closed. People, I really don't like when people stare at you like at stoplights. But whenever I'm parked, I always talk about this. People like stare into my car. Oh, thank you guys also for all the advice on the window tinting. I may do it. I just need to like, probably not during Mercury Retrograde. So right now Mercury's gonna, Mercury's in retrograde until May 3rd, Saturn's in retrograde until August 25th, and Venus is gonna be out of retrograde on the 15th, so. Guess where I'm back with an icon, Christina. <laughs> Link her IG down below. <laughs> She's the- A little hairspray. Uh, what, what brand is this? Kevin Murphy. Oh, I like, I like. I like that one spray, like the texture spray, it's like purple. Uh-huh. Is that the one? No, that's Moroccan oil. No, the one that's like the what the packaging is like pa all pastel colors. What brand is that? Oh yeah, that's ours. That's Kevin Murphy. Oh yeah, pastel. Oh, the pastel. Is it that orange one that I like? Yeah, it's that one. I really like that one. It's so good. Is that the one that smells good too? Mhm. Mm mm. It's all essential oil based. Can I smell it again? I don't know that one. Oh. <laughs> this one's all essential oil. That one. This is hers. Are all of, uh, everything? Yeah. It's cruelty free. I know. Kevin. <laughs> Kevin's so good. Kevin's so nice. I love this one. Oh, I love that. Do they have it in the store? Mm hmm. I want to get it. You want to get it? You have to get it? Mm hmm. I can grab it though. Oh, yeah, I love it. I love it so much. Just do your little hot rollers in there. Mm hmm. And then I can spread it in after. Well, maybe don't hold it that close to you. Is that bad? <laughs> it's like straight 
song. It's just kind of like Misa Harris. Misa Harris song. <laughs> it's Chris. It's like it's freezing. It's like literally like a goop of hair spray. Could I, could I put like a light oil to put here? I get so annoyed with these people. You are so <laughs> demanding today. It's a, it's, a, it's all it's the four planets in retrograde. Saturn's retrograde too. So either you're gonna have a, if you've been a good person for the past year, it's gonna be the most lit time of your life until August. Well, I don't. I can't say that any of us have been like perfectly good. But like, like, like majority of your intentions, you're a Cancer. You're nice. <laughs> okay, I'll take it. But like, if you've been good, it's gonna be so good. This happens like every two years. Get excited. I've been a good person. I'm excited then. So I just got my hair toned. It looks a little more ashy as you can see in these colors. I mean, it's, it's not, these extensions don't take the toner as well. My, my other ones did, Bombay, but I hate Bombay because they're awful customer service, awful shipping, d don't recommend. These are, I forgot the brand, I'll ask her when she gets back, but um, these don't take as intensely, but like finally they are silvery. Like, it's, maybe I don't know if you can see, but they are silver. Like, they're more toned. They were literally like this, like, because this is my real hair, so they're like more like, they weren't as toned, they were like more, I don't want to say brassy, but golden, and now they're more toned. It's a slight difference, but I really like, <laughs> and I always like, I, I like to put oil right here because I hate when it gets like, I have little baby hairs right there, but it looks so cute, looks so good. I'm wearing my favorite like, Boohoo sweater, I'll link it down below. Also, Boo this is not sponsored, wish it was, bought this, but Boohoo sent me like a code. They're like, I can give your followers a 30% off code, so remind me to put it down there if I didn't already. But yeah, I'm in at Salon Republic with Christina, and I'll put her number in the description if you want to book with her. I'm not, don't get anything out of it, I pay, <laughs> but um, she's drinking her refresher. Someone else brought her a green juice, competing with me. Rude. Dry powder finishing hairspray. So it's a hairspray. It's a hairspray. It's like, a, but it's like texture. texture. It's like the same thing as like texture. Oh, it smells so good. This is, this is the quality content that we're at Salon Republic for. Oh my gosh. You know what bothers me? I really like the Olaplex conditioner, but it's so expensive and it only lasts me one use. So it's kind of yeah. rude. It's really mean. You should only use it like once a week or something. My hair is done. Here you can see actually how toned it looks. It looks pretty ashy, which I'm excited about. I do want it more and more silver, but like I just I already left the toner on for literally an hour. And I just really don't, don't have the time just to sit for two hours with the toner. Oh my god, this is really creepy. Like I don't even have Beyonce and like Apple Music or anything. But every time I start my car, um, she starts playing. I don't know, it's like off of Spotify, which I, I don't have any of her, like, there's no reason why I should, I don't have her in anything, I don't like Beyonce, like, her music, to be honest, nothing against her, and like, it just restarts playing, have a good day, I love that guy, um, so, oh my god, I'm creeping, but, um, just going home now, I'm going to put on, like, wing liner and some lashes, and I'm going to do, oh, a... A video, I have to film a video and I have to, um, I want to edit it to have it ready for tomorrow. Right now it's like 5 o'clock, so probably get home at like, hopefully like, hopefully like 5.30, honestly. Because there's just so much traffic, I'm going to call my mom, because she called me, and then, yeah, I'm going to edit a video, film a video. I mean, film a video, edit a video, and then I have two vlogs to edit to make sure they go up tomorrow and Wednesday, like, on time. And then after that, I'm probably going to meditate the new moon, the, the full moon is tonight. And it's a pretty intense, just because the, there's four planets in retrograde right now, and the full moon's in Libra. With the with the alignment, it's just kind of a little intense, and I'm like already in my period, and I'm a Gemini, so I just really need to like center myself, because if you're a Gemini, I, get, I just easily get like emotional roller coaster. Like very rarely, but when I do, it's like, oh honey. Oh, it's like a red G-Wagon, I've never seen that. So cute, love that. Um, but yeah, this was popping today. I'm talking so much today. I'm very talkative, which is I'm taking. I like that because some days I do. I don't want to talk at all. I'm very just like. Mm. So when I want to talk, it's just like yes. Also, hi. another one of you bought my 10 week thing, which I'm so excited about. So now, um, there's four spots left, and it's just so crazy. And also, uh, people who are like, I want to address this commenting. They're like, oh my gosh, $990. Like first of all, an hour Skype every week. That's already like that's already like. 
$90 an hour is very normal for any type of Skype coaching session, especially because my time is so limited and I know what I'm worth and I know how much knowledge I have to share. And then also that includes a birth chart, which is normally 50 and a Reiki, which you literally can Google like Reiki from people anywhere, even if you live like not in like LA, like my friend Allie, she was like researching Reiki in Montreal and even like an hour Reiki is $115 versus you're getting the 10 weeks and the Reiki and materials and the birth chart. like. Literally, like people, uh, people who I've, I've consulted about are like, that's literally like, that's like not high. And I know it's like a lot to put out at once, but it's an investment in yourself. And it's kind of just like when you invest like in a car or like, like so you know, something like that. It's like, yes, it's like a lot at first, but it's like you have to realize like how much it's worth, you know? I've invested in like hypnotherapy, which, yeah, at first it's like a large sum to lay down, but when you like look at the weeks and the worth, you know what I mean? There's like a monthly membership. When you pay for spin, it's like, well, obviously, are hundreds of dollars, but when you like lay it out per class, it ends up being like a normal price. You know what I mean? So I don't. I just want to address that. I'm not trying to like scam or like make so much money off of it. It's actually like a very like reasonable and good deal. Like it's so much. It's like ten weeks and a re and a birth chart and like so many resources within each week. Like you could literally, if you want to do a tarot with me every single week, which any tarot an hour reading of tarot. I'm not kidding. Just Google it. Like Google a person who does an hour reading of tarot is usually a hundred dollars. I swear to you. Like you know what I'm saying. So it's like. Or, or over a hundred. Like most people do forty min forty dollars for twenty minutes. So. Uh, what, what an hour $120 per session like and you, if you wanted I could do tarot for you every single week if, like you just really wanted to like see what's going on give you updates do you know what I'm saying we could be doing rituals which in like going to a session for someone to train you to do a ritual is so expensive like if you're into spirituality you know like what kind of like good deal this is and how I'm making it so like actually very chill because everything that would be doing itself would be so expensive but I'm like I'm keeping it open that you can do literally anything you want every single week with me even if it's like worth like in a more amount I mean, and if you want to do more than one reiki i wanted to mention this like if you wanted to like do like let's say you feel like really stuck one like after three weeks you can use one of the hour sessions as like the reiki so like that's like another you know what i mean hundred dollars like you could do that you know so making it very reasonable making it very expansive like if one week you're like can you do like can we do a meditation can we do can i get a 20 minute reiki and a tarot we could do that as one of the week sessions which that would be itself worth like over 200 dollars. you know what i'm saying so i just wanted to address that but yeah, i'm driving i'm going to call my mom back um i love you guys so much so i'll talk to y'all the stars are all around the stars are all around I'm changing